Today we're going to talk about the North Pole of Saturn. And before I got into this whole journey, before I wrote my book on, uh, which is almost finished, on homeopathy 3.0, I became sort of obsessed with two phenomena, cymatics and the North Pole of Saturn. Cymatics, of course, when you look at it, has this very interesting phenomena going on that you can just visually see. And it's very, uh, you can see the transformations from one state to another of the, of the sand structures. Now, the North Pole of Saturn I found interesting was two things. That there's a gigantic hexagon cloud structure, or hexagon-shaped cloud structure on the North Pole of Saturn. It's been stable for, for 30 years, at least what we know of. And that, so that's one part of that. And then the other part is that we never hear about it anywhere, ever. But you can find the pictures on NASA's and JPL's website. Now, <clears throat> and I got my theories on why the North Pole of Saturn has that shape. It's at the North Pole, so there's a lot of plasma coming in. And plasma does take on certain characteristics. It does have wave uh, or cymatic-like uh, characteristics it can part into matter. So I think it's some kind of a plasma effect of some kind. And if you look at the interplanetary medium, it is plasma. So I'm gonna. This is a brief video. I'm just gonna. I'm, I'm already pretty much. I've already pretty much covered what I want to talk about. And we're gonna just look at uh, some images of um, Saturn and its North Pole. And it is just absolutely amazing. And I've seen some other work that deals with the harmonic relationship between a six-sided system, which is a hexagon, and a five-sided system, which would be a pentagon or a pentagonal system, a pentagram or a pentagonal system. Now, if you look at the body, if you look at a lot of plants and um, things like that, you can see the six-sided and five-sided systems uh, doing like an interplay. You know, if you look at the body, we have five fingers, which is pentagonal, which is a little illusory because really this is different than this and it is all sorts of other weird phenomena for, that, for example you have one bone two bone four bones so they're kind of doubling each time right um things like that in the body that you can see but if you look at the body from another perspective we're six-sided because if you look at the arms and the tail that's one triangle people have a tail but we it's been kind of shrunken so it looks like we have five appendages including the head right but then when you look um, um, at the, the legs and the head, you have another triangle, so it creates like a Star of David type of shape, which at the inside of it is a pentagram or penta pentagonal shape. Um, <clears throat> so check out this video, I think it's really interesting, or check out the pictures that are coming up, and um, it's just truly fascinating stuff. And just allow this to just open up your mind, because another example is, and I was watching this video on the Discovery Channel. They were talking about, it was I think it was entitled, The Mysteries of the Solar System. When it went to Saturn, they didn't talk about nothing about the, the North Pole of Saturn. They talked about the rings, which is you can't kind of get away from that because it's just so prominent. But they didn't talk about anything about the North Pole. It's not so obvious. Um, but I, I, by the way, recently got some really awesome images, and I'm going to be putting them up. So, um, hey, check it out. Ponder.